All right, guys, today I am giving you my full review on this Active On CX Gold uh, camera. So, a lot of people don't know about this, but I'm going to actually tell, show you the external mic hookup um, that a lot of people don't realize. Uh, but let's take the camera out. I'm going to go through all the features and I'm going to stay tuned with the video. Um, I'm going to be splicing um, footage from this, ca from this camera into uh, the video. And then you can see the quality of some of the pictures and things like that that way. Now, the biggest drawback I find in this camera, now this package was a good deal, okay? So let me explain what it comes with first. So it comes with two batteries. It comes with this waterproof case. It also comes with an eight gig SD card, okay? Which is actually a micro SD card, which is actually in there already. Um, and that's about it. Um, so, the quality on the image is actually quite good. Okay, so let me show you. That's the image. It actually records on this nice little widescreen sort of thing, and it actually is quite good. But the drawback here is one big thing: is the microphone. Okay, so the mic that's actually on this is actually not the greatest quality. Okay, and the gr the microphone is not good in the sense that. It doesn't really, it's all scratchy and it doesn't give you a lot of good depth in the, in the volume. But I have here is an external mic, okay? A lot of people don't know about this, but you can actually plug an external mic into this uh, active on camera. And how you do it is actually quite simple. So let me just, and you get one of these little microphones for pretty cheap, inexpensively. And this is an external mic. You can, you know, clip it to yourself and things like that. You can also get a stereo mic. I also, I'm getting a stereo mic. It's actually being sent to me, um, but it's not here yet. But I wanted to show you guys what it looks like. So this goes in there, right? So now this micro, uh, or sorry, not micro, yeah, US mini, uh, USB mini goes right there. Now you can use the external mic. So there we go. You can take that out. You can put this in, and then you will be using the external mic from there. Um, so I'm going to be doing a testing on the sound quality, and then you guys can hear the difference between it. Um, but overall, it's a really good camera. You get 1080p. You can do 720, 60 frames per second. Um, really good in that sense. I strongly recommend it. But stay tuned for my reviews, and you guys could be the judge of it for yourself. Um, that way you'll know if it's really good for you in that sense um, but i love the camera so stay tuned guys and don't forget to subscribe to the channel All right, so this is the external mic testing one two three testing one two three. I'm covering up the holes on the uh, the camera as as we speak, just in case sound is leaking through. So uh, testing one two three. I'm going to remove the microphone right now. This is the um, the the microphone that's on the camera built in. This is testing one two three testing one two three. This is 1080p and this is 30 frames per second, also wide. So, give you guys a good look. Alright, and stay tuned for a full review.